Hello students, welcome to Top Scholars. Today we are going to learn a very interesting topic that is thermos flask. Whenever we see a thermos flask, these are the parts that can be observed. First is the cup. Second is the cork stopper. Third is the vacuum. Fourth is obviously hot or cold liquid. Fifth is your silvered surface. Sixth is the double walled metal or plastic container and the last one is the insulated support. So this was all about construction of thermos flask. Let's understand the principle of thermos flask that is how does the thermos flask keeps a liquid hot or cold for a long period of time. Obviously students this is done by reducing heat transfer by conduction, convection and radiation. Let's understand how this is done one by one. Preventing heat transfer by conduction and convection. This is achieved simply by creating vacuum between the double walled space. This is simply achieved by creating vacuum between the double walled space. And students remember one thing, conduction and convection require medium to occur because Heat transfer by conduction and convection is only possible if there is presence of medium. And since as we know that vacuum is absence of medium, there is no heat transfer by conduction and convection. To learn more about this topic, download Top Scholars app.